Hello my people, how are you guys doing? I'll go by the Dingy's Coast Prince and if you are new to my channel, welcome. So guys, I'm going to do a reaction today to um, Vector's Freestyle in um, Cool FM. I think he did it in Cool FM. So I'm going to watch Vector and see how Vector freestyles. You know, this one is titled The Vector Freestyle. This Vector Freestyle could have blown, could have your mind blown. Anyway, guys, let's watch this and see if Vector doing his thing. You want to know how easy he does it? It's one of the best freestyle artists in art in Nigeria. So, guys, let's go. The best of the best, East Coast Springs. I know it's better than the rest. East Coast Springs, the rap in no one contest. East Coast Springs. King David, aka the One Man Army. Our ladies call me Jay. Some man love me. <laughs> fear people like me because one man love me and I know fake people because one man love me that's that military swag fam mount guns heavy with the sands in the back so I'm roll with gorilla wait 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 I'm taking it back you use them um, a wordplay with one man one man love me uh, I don't really know much of Yoruba so I can't really explain what that means but I think he used it in two different um, contexts in, the, in this freestyle there let's go I mean <laughs> fear people like me because one man love me and I know fake people because one man love me that's that military swag fam mount guns heavy with the sands in the back so I'm we roll with gorillas I'm like Tarzan so I'm we roll with gorillas I'm like Tarzan that's some heavy line there we roll with gorillas we roll with the big boys I'm like Tarzan because Tarzan literally grew up with gorillas let's go that's come man he was like look man a bad man and i could get you any damn song i'm like your shazam and all you rappers weak are active wait 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 he said something guns heavy with the sands in the back so i'm we roll with gorillas i'm like tarzan so i met that's come man he was like look man a bad man and i could get you any damn song i'm like your shazam he said, man, he said he met someone and the guy is like um man a bad man i can get you any damn song it's like you're shazam because basically shazam is what you used to trace songs if you know this shazam up you know that if you don't know any song, Shazam can actually help you identify the song. Says so like, are you Shazam that he said you can get me any damn song? That's some good metaphor. Let's go. And all you rappers weak, I activate many more bars than nightlife. All for the cut. Wait, wait, wait. <laughs> See all you rappers weak, I activate many more bars than nightlife because basically, in the night time, everybody goes to the bar to chill, goes to the club to the bar to chill. So that's the nightlife, basically the grooving life of people going to the bars going to the bars nightlife mode so like i activate many more bars like i'm nightlife because he activates bars literally it's rap bars but also talking about nightlife and literally the the bar you go to chill and get a drink come on this is chilling on this one let's go like your shazam and all you rappers weak i activate many more bars than nightlife all for the cut that's the knife life when i hit mm, no survivors at the crash site <laughs> when i hit no survivors at the crash site mad when he hits you with the punches you don't survive it but when he hits like when the car hits a car when he hits no survivors at the crash site amazing man let's go off of the cut that's the knife life when i hit mm, no survivors at the crash site <laughs> <laughs> destroy you all from the inside is the rap parasite i think i don't want to rap I'm a boy. For learning this out, even DJ Mafurisa, the lyrical version that you obeyed as Ebenezer and I could authorize your entry to heaven. V is a visa. <laughs> Man, like his um his word plays and that is just does that rap scheme there is just interesting to to actually watch and listen to. Man, please tell me some things I miss out on, especially the Yoruba stuff that he's saying, because I don't understand Yoruba as much. Let's go version that you obey that's Ebenezer and I could authorize your entry to heaven V is a visa so that's how I'm the father about to turn the son into a spirit how Christian is that fake or real I'm the father about to turn the son into a spirit how Christian is that because basically in the Christian dom there's a trinity which is father son and holy spirit so let's go would you be the former and I'll be the ER? How Christian is that? And see, my girl is do you be the former and I'll be the ER? How Christian is that? So he's talking about designers now. That's a designer scheme. You'll be the former and I'll be the ER. Um, how Christian is that? Talking about Christian Dior. Let's go. That. Fake or real, you'll be the former and I'll be the ER. How Christian is that? And see, my girl is the ish. She on that Lou Boutin. I ask again, how Christian, how Christian is that? Is that? 
my girl is the A. She's she's on that little bull thing. She's on that little bull thing. She's the A. She's on that little bull thing. How? Uh, how? What do you see? How Christian is that? Did I say because little bit little between little between designers stuff like that so you see on that designer skin i see my girl is the ish she on that blue boot tin i ask again how christian, how christian is, that? is that then i see pastors engaging forces with voodoo rings i ask again how, how christian, christian is, that? is that and so man <laughs> wow schemes god schemes man schemes vector is fire schemes jeez ah let's go pastors engaging forces with voodoo rings I ask again, how yeah, Christian, Christian is that? Is that? <laughs> and so you see, the way we reason and isn't the way you reason with you, you might sell an album, but me, I may go to prison. So you knew from the start, while I was reading, you weren't reading, and that's the only reason why you take money from politicians. See, we know you're politicking when you're acting tough. Your story no longer lifting. Why are you acting buff? You don't. You know you're politicking when you're acting tough. Your story no longer lifting. Why are you acting buff? Basically, because your story is no longer lifting people's spirits, because now you're now doing shady things with politicians but now i say why are you acting buff because literally lifting heavy stuff why are you acting buff why are you acting like you you've gone to the gym and you have lifted heavy weights and you're not buff so that's some interesting scheme there let's go See, we know you're politicking when you're acting tough. Your story no longer lifting. Why are you acting so buff? Well. You don't inspire. The relevance on any level that you desire would be stupid if you knew art doesn't really expire. Meaning you no longer see yourself as that. Oh, wow. LOL. See this man. He a fraud. We are not on the same level anyways. And I'm done. Yay. Thank you. And on this note, guys, Becca is out of the studio. We're back to regular <coughs> programming on the road. I don't know why. Almost anything I hear from Vector right now, I just take it as a subliminal. To MI because this point he said here, yeah, this last point about the whole, um, um, you can't go to prison, then you are doing things with politicians, and um, the story no longer lifting. Why are you acting buff and all those things? I remember this from a year ago. So, a year ago, him and, him and MI still had that heat going on. So, I could, I could feel and actually feel that this was actually a subliminal to MI right now. Anything I hear from Victor from way back. I just feel like there's a subliminal going on there, right there for Emma. Because even when he did the Judas the Rat, he was like, You are coming here to act like you're lifting people, but you are there playing for somebody, but you are there um, taking deals with politicians and uh, making money. And you are playing, basically telling uh, Emma that it's all about the cash, and he is not. So I think here too, doing that stuff here, that last scheme again, I just feel like. The subliminals with MI. I don't know if you guys feel the same, but that's what I feel. Anyway, I'm taking it back a little bit because of the way he said it and the serious face he kept. Let's go. Meaning you no longer see yourself as that. Oh wow, LOL. See this man, he a fraud. We are not on the same level anyways, and I'm done. Yeah. We are not on the same level anyways, and I'm done. Who would be telling that if not M? I'm just saying. Anyway. Now they've squashed the beef, so I'm not going to. I'm not instigating anything. Basically, just be saying what I'm what I observed from the freestyle. Guys, I enjoyed this freestyle. Come on, Vector knows how to come with the punchlines and the scheme. You know, Vector for very good metaphorical, bar heavy lyricism and some intricate lines that you need to actually go to the books to dissect and bisect and whatever. In fact, just you need to just go there and really sink in the. And this one, this freestyle was actually more like a, a spoken word poetry. It was a cappella freestyle, no beat on. And you could still see how heavy, how bar heavy it was. So guys, um, tell me if you enjoyed this one. I did. I did enjoy it. Um, shout out to Vector. Shout out to anyone watching this. And if you are new to my channel, please don't forget to leave a like or leave a comment. And guys, I'll see you in my next music video reaction. And with that being said, people, peace.